There are some really exciting opportunities opening up in the print on demand space. And the newest one is actually Amazon POD. So that is where you utilize a company like Printify that can print and ship your products and you connect it to Amazon where there is a massive marketplace of buyers ready to buy products from you. Now this is completely different from merch by Amazon, which you may or may not be familiar with. So a lot of print on demand sellers have anxiously been waiting for this exact rollout, which just happened about two weeks ago. So this is a very, very exciting rollout. And now if you are new to the print on demand space or thinking about getting started, this is an opportunity for you to get in on something early. There have been many, many shifts in the print on demand space over the years. And some of you may remember in 2020, the absolute explosion that happened with print on demand on Etsy. It seemed like almost anyone that was opening a shop during that period of time was just having rapid success. Now, since then, a lot has changed. Etsy has become unfavorable with a lot of print-on-demand sellers. I personally still like the platform. However, when it comes to growth and opportunity, Amazon is definitely where it's at moving forward. We also, of course, have a TikTok shop, which has been all the rage for about a year or so now. I did make another video about that last week, which I will link down below for you. So let's go ahead and break down all things Amazon and discuss why now is is the hottest time for you to get started with this opportunity. So the three different categories on Amazon is actually Amazon FBA, Merch by Amazon, and now Amazon POD. So let's break down the differences between those and why you should be excited about the POD element. So with Amazon FBA, this is where you have already completed stock that is housed in an Amazon warehouse, and that goes along with Amazon Prime, right? So when someone makes a purchase, it ships from their warehouse with an Amazon vehicle and it gets to the customer within two days. In order to do the opportunity, you have to invest upfront a lot of money and have inventory sitting somewhere in the Amazon warehouse with no guarantee to sell, right? So there's a lot of upfront costs with that. Next, we have Merch by Amazon, and that is where you can do a form of print on demand that Amazon actually runs. So you would make your own designs, upload those into say apparel like t-shirts and sweatshirts over on Amazon and Amazon will print and ship those for you. Now the downside with Merch by Amazon is it's actually really hard to get into and not a lot of people were actually able to do that. So this is why everyone has been waiting for this Amazon POD option. And if you have a shop connected with Printify and Etsy, it works almost exactly the same way. And if you already have those designs loaded up into your Printify, it's gonna be super simple for you to expand your business by taking those done for you designs and just publishing them over to Amazon. Now, the downside of doing Amazon POD is that basically you're the one fulfilling the orders, not Amazon. And so the items are not going to get to the customer within two days, right? Because your print provider with Printify is going to be printing and shipping those packages. So you're gonna have to get a little bit of creative to set yourself apart from those people that are using Amazon FBA and Merch by Amazon. So before we get into all of those details, let's just quickly compare the different platforms that I've discussed on this channel so you can understand the pros, the cons, and the benefits of each. So we have a TikTok shop, and this is a super hot opportunity right now, and the awesome thing about it is it's actually free to get started. There's no shop setup fees, no listing fees. All that you have to pay is a transaction fee when something sells. And the transaction fee is lower than most other platforms around three to 4%. Now the negative is, is because it's so easy to get started with, anybody can do that, that it's going to open it up to more competition. Next, we have Etsy, which I have tons of videos about on my channel here. And Etsy has been a great free platform to get started with. However, now they are switching it over to you have to pay $15 to open a shop. And then they also have a listing fees of 20 cents every time you list an item. And then they also have transaction fees of about 6%. So Etsy is currently raising the bar on the barrier to entry. This could be a good thing though, because it can weed out some of your competition that don't want to pay those extra fees. Now we have Amazon POD with the Printify integration 
and when you sell on Amazon there is a free plan however if you want to do what we're talking about today print on demand and connect it to Printify there's actually going to be a $39 a month fee for setting up your shop there now that sounds like a lot however there are a ton of benefits and that is because Amazon as a marketplace has been dominated for a very long time they are way bigger than Etsy and people go to Amazon every single day for all of their everyday needs and they're not just a marketplace just for gifts although we are going to talk about gifts in just a moment now another maybe downer is that they have a 15% transaction fee which is extremely high however when you take into consideration the actual buyer marketplace and the amount of people that you can get your offer in front of and the timing that we are in right now you're definitely going to want to consider this and by the end of this video I'm sure you're going to want to jump on this so those are all the pros and cons of each platform now let's go ahead and talk about products that you can be selling so if you've been currently selling print on demand on Etsy or any other platform, you can now just publish those same listings directly from Printify that you already have saved in your account over to Amazon to multiply your income, right? Um, if you've already put in the work, I don't know why you wouldn't do this. It's smart to go ahead and utilize the effort that you've already done to start increasing your sales. And a lot of the same things that have worked over on Etsy are also going to translate to working over on Amazon now the product that I would recommend especially for the Q4 Christmas season coming up is mugs now I have several other videos on my channel here all about mugs now dating back to like 2018 2019 when I first started print on demand one of my very first orders was a custom Christmas mug where someone from a sorority actually bought 50 mugs from me and so i went in and customized those and shipped those off to the sorority and that was an awesome payday for me when i first got started on my journey now mugs continue to be great sellers and especially when you can add the customized element to it when people are searching for holidays and they're looking for gifts oftentimes when they go to purchase these custom mugs they'll buy multiples at a time right not only did i have the sorority that originally bought 50 mugs in one order but i've had over time families that will go grandmas that will buy mugs for all of their grandchildren so they can have their hot cocoa with their marshmallows on christmas day it's a really fun and sentimental gift and when you're adding the customized element to it especially over on amazon that is what is going to set you apart and also make it worth it for the customers to wait a little longer to get their purchase now the one downside of doing custom items with print on demand is that you actually have to individually create every single customization right and that sort of takes away the beauty of print on demand because the idea is to upload your designs and then have those selling for you in the background without you having to do anything additional right completely automated um, however there are now ways to automate that process so you don't have to do what I did back in the day which is going through and individually making those so when I had that order of 50 mugs then I had to go individually do that and that took me all day to do so I'm going to link a tool for you down in the description to actually help you automate that process if this is something that you're interested in and if you would like more tutorials on that please let me know down below in the comments so when it comes to selling mugs you want to think unique quirky fun something funny something that people wouldn't see um, ever, anywhere else and you also want to think like I said holiday themes because we are coming up on the holiday rush and if you get those orders up there is a good chance that you can start getting orders right away now of course if you've never done this before there may be a slight learning curve for you and your designs may not be very good in the beginning however over time they will definitely improve and you can also use very simple design hacks like a platform like creative fabrica where they already have a done for you designs that you can then combine with the customization so for example reindeer snowmen Santa Claus and so many different options that you can search over on creative fabrica to help you get your designs up and ready to go so I hope that you are as excited as I am about this opportunity we are in a golden window of time right now to take advantage of this boom before it happens
happens. Opportunities like this only come up every few years and the fact that POD with Amazon is happening right now, you're never going to see an opportunity like this again when it comes to print on demand with Amazon. So if you were on Etsy before 2020 and that crazy boom that happened, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And if you weren't, if you didn't get to experience that, maybe now is the time that you finally get to experience being first at something awesome. So I'm going to be working on taking my hundreds of Printify products and publishing them over to Amazon. And I look forward to keeping you guys updated on how that goes. And so I just want to finish this off by encouraging you to take the first step. Take the first step in faith, right? You don't have to see the entire staircase to get started. You just have to put one foot in front of the other and the rest will unfold as you go, right? You can truly learn and earn with this opportunity. Now, just remember, like anything online, this isn't a get rich quick thing. This is going to take a little level of skill, a little bit of learning and consistency, but anything worth doing takes effort, right? Anything worth doing takes time, but the reward that will come from that will be so, so great. So you've got this, I'm here to support you. If you have any questions, feel free to go ahead and ask those down below. And if you would like to see more videos on this topic, please let me know down below. I'm also going to link for you down below in the description box, a link for Printify. So if you haven't signed up with them yet, you can get started 100% free. I'm also going to share additional tutorials that will be helpful for you in creating the products along with the automated customizations.